Yeah, Craig, I spoke with the Barnum and Police Chief today who tells me that that fourth grade boy is actually right now in the hospital in surgery. He said that right now, at this point, he is expected to survive. He had to make the decision of hitting the school bus or going left or right, and he decided to go right. And that right turn truck driver James Murphy made claimed the life of seven-year-old Valeria Montero and seriously injured her older brother. Emergency responders airlifted the fourth grader to Le Bonheur Hospital in Memphis, where today... They post do surgery on him, on his hip and his femur, and uh, at... As of now, there's no life-threatening injuries. According to Vardaman Police Chief Kenneth Scott, Murphy said there was no way he could stop his truck in time. Scott said Murphy told investigators he tried to avoid another 18-wheeler going east and crossed into the westbound lane. Scott said Murphy came close to hitting a school bus full of children head-on. He said to avoid the bus, Murphy crossed over into the right lane where seven-year-old Valeria and her brother were walking. MDOT, uh, Mississippi Department of Transportation, doing an inspection of the truck. Right now, 70-year-old James Murphy of Vaden is charged with manslaughter. Now, that accident happened as the school bus was still there, sitting in that same two-lane road where the accident actually took place, and students were still on the bus, according to the police chief. Now, he did say that those students did see the actual crash. Today, I spoke with counselors as they came to the schools today to help those children cope. That story tonight at 6. But for now, reporting live in Calhoun County, Aaron Wilson, WTVA 9 News.